4.10 Part 3 Eloise will go, said Hartley angrily. I haven't had one day without problems since I met her. You are right, Vivian. Eloise must go before I can take you home. But she will go. I have decided. Then, said Vivian, my answer is yes. I will be yours. She looked into his eyes, and Hartley could hardly believe his luck. Promise me, he said. I promise, repeated Vivian softly. At the door, he turned and looked at her happily. I will come for you tomorrow, he said. Tomorrow, she repeated with a smile. An hour and forty minutes later, Hartley stepped off the train when it stopped in the suburbs and walked to his house. As he walked towards the door, a woman ran to him. She had black hair and was wearing a long white dress. They kissed and walked into the house. <laughs>